Exciting news for royal style fans. There are whispers that Catherine, Princess of Wales, might wear a tiara before the year wraps up. As we know, this 42-year-old royal has spent much of 2023 out of the spotlight, focusing on her health. This means we've seen very few style moments from the future queen. But now, as she prepares to return to public life, a royal historian suggests we could see her donning a tiara for a significant royal family event. Tell us in the comments, how do you feel about tiaras making a comeback? Catherine has shown incredible courage while battling her health challenges, sharing her raw emotions and steely resolve that have become constant companions on this journey. It's a bit of a mystery why Catherine and William have chosen now to open up so much, especially with their recent film that gives us a glimpse into their lives. Perhaps they feel they've been quiet for too long, and there's a public desire to know how she's doing and if she can return to the royal stage amidst these challenges. What do you think? Is it important for them to share their journey with the public? In the film, Catherine emphasizes that cancer is merely a name, stripped of its sinister connotations. She insists it's not a death sentence but rather a challenge to face with courage and unwavering determination. It's truly inspiring to see such a positive outlook, especially with King Charles still recovering from his own health battles. Some critics have argued that the royals aren't providing value for money during these trying times, but watching Catherine gracefully navigate her family life dispels such notions. Royals are human too, facing unexpected crises just like the rest of us. What do you think makes them relatable to the public? In a surprising turn of events, Catherine has decided to step back from her role as mediator in the ongoing feud between Prince William and Prince Harry. This decision underscores her commitment to prioritizing her health and focusing on what truly matters. The film powerfully illustrates how love can uplift someone dealing with cancer, especially during those long, dark nights. Catherine's honesty shines through as she expresses that her journey isn't over yet. Tell us in the comments, do you think she made the right choice to step back? Catherine shares, my path to healing and full recovery is long. Her words have resonated deeply with supporters who've rallied around her, showering her with love and unwavering support. Across the nation, vigils have been held, fundraising initiatives launched, and social media has been filled with messages of encouragement. It's heartwarming to see such solidarity from the public. How do you feel about the way people have come together to support her? The royal family has expressed heartfelt gratitude for the kindness shown by the public during this challenging time. Catherine acknowledges the vital role of the medical professionals guiding her through this journey. According to an Italian publication, a distinguished team of specialists from the Jamal Clinic was flown to London for a high-stakes operation. This team gained international recognition for performing a successful operation on Pope Francis, showing just how serious the situation was. Isn't it amazing how the medical community can come together for such important work? It's essential to approach public speculation about the health of royal figures with caution and respect. Privacy and dignity are paramount in these situations, and it's vital to respect the royal family's decisions regarding the release of medical information. Catherine is a mother of three young children, and I'm glad to hear she's cancer-free now and can spend more quality time with them. Tell us in the comments, how do you think this will impact her role as a mother and a royal? As she gradually returns to her royal engagements, the program is likely to be light, with potential appearances at events like Remembrance Sunday. However, announcements may come last minute, depending on how she feels. It's a reminder that every cancer journey is different, and it's important to be patient and understanding. What are your thoughts on the royals balancing their public duties with personal challenges? In summary, Catherine's story highlights the importance of resilience and support during tough times. As she navigates her journey toward recovery, let's continue to rally behind her. If you enjoyed this update on Catherine, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more royal news. Your thoughts are always welcome so keep the conversation going in the comments.